Hi there, I'm Holly Chandler of the Julie Kinnear team and I'm standing in front of 56 Armadale, which is in the beautiful, exclusive enclave of Swansea. It really is one of the best streets in the area. It's a, a really short walk to either the Jane or Runnymede station, all the shopping. Runny Park is close by, the paths along the Humber, uh, around High Park and the lake are really easily accessed. And of course, the Swansea Junior Senior School and Humberside are very coveted schools. So this house is a Tudor style. It has a 33 foot frontage. It fronts on the west, so you get beautiful sunsets in the backyard. It has an attached garage, parking for three cars, so private driveway. And then the garage, it's had a number of updates. We've got uh, new front railings. And inside, the floors have been refinished. There's no knob and tube. That was all removed recently. So, completely updated electrical. And so here we are. So we're in the living room. We've got a really elegant uh, mantelpiece in the rich wood, original wood. We've got uh, refinished hardwood floors and beautiful gumwood. We have a front hall closet. So, buyers always love that. And uh, you see these original leaded glass windows that um, are in pristine condition throughout the house. So, again, there are the leaded windows. Taking off my boots there. Okay, so. The living room opens up into the dining room, so it has really good flow. The dining room's light and bright, has wainscoting. Everything has been freshly painted in this house. That room just beyond the, the uh, dining room there is the sunroom, which I'll take you through in a moment. One of those classic swing doors. So going into the kitchen. So the kitchen's the original kitchen, but uh, it's wooden cabinets. And they've been freshly painted, so you can take time to decide what you want to do with the kitchen. You could use them as is. They're um, quite, quite functional. It's quite a spacious kitchen. And then we've got the breakfast nook off the back, which goes out into the backyard. And we have this uh, sunroom here, which is great for having a little drink. The summer sunsets. And then the backyard. So the backyard has a deck with built-in seating. It's all fenced in. And uh, these cedars here take up uh, quite a bit of space. It's about 10 feet from the front to the back. So the, uh, the backyard is actually more spacious than it actually appears. So again, a little sunroom. And I will take you down into the basement. So it's got fresh broadloom. There's a side entrance, which uh, makes it possible to have a home office, um, could be a nanny suite, and uh, it's really quite a bonus to have that. So it's been freshly painted throughout. And it's... Uh, Got a good amount of space here. And got a uh, little space here, which would be great for um, a little desk area, a little play area. And yes, that noisy thing there, that is, uh, it is an oil heater. And uh, it's uh, an oil tank. The sellers looked into uh, exchanging it through Direct Energy. They got a quote of $6,600 to remove the tank and um, to bring in the gas lines and change the furnace. So $6,600 is not bad at all. And it's uh, they put themselves on the queue so the buyer can take over that and uh, not have to have such a long wait before getting that switched. Got a three-piece bathroom, freshly tiled. So, very functional, enclosed shower, and 
And they've got this enormous laundry room here. And I'll take you back upstairs.